Hello, this is Raymond here again with today's Bible reading. Today we're going to be reading in the book of Hosea, chapter 5. Hear ye this, O priest, and hearken ye house of Israel, and give ye ear, O house of the king, for judgment is toward you, because ye have been a snare on Mizbah, and a net spread upon Tabor. And the revolters are profound to make slaughter, though I have been a rebuker of them all. I know Ephraim, and Israel is not hid from me. For now, O Ephraim, thou committest whoredom, and Israel is defiled. They will not frame their doings to turn unto their God, for the spirit of whoredoms is in the midst of them, and they have not known the Lord. And the pride of Israel doth testify to his face. Therefore shall Israel and Ephraim fall in their iniquity. Judah also shall fall with them. They shall go with their flocks and with their herds to seek the Lord, but they shall not find him. He hath withdrawn himself from them. They have dealt treacherously against the Lord, for they have begotten strange children. Now shall a month devour them with their portions. Blow ye the cornet in Gilbeah, and the trumpet in Ramah. Cry aloud at beth Avon, and after thee, O Benjamin. Ephraim shall be desolate in the day of rebuke. Among the tribes of Israel have I made known that which shall surely be. The princes of Judah were like them that removed the bond. Therefore I will pour out my wrath upon them like water. Ephraim is oppressed and broken in judgment, because he willingly walked after the commandment. Therefore will I be unto Ephraim as a moth, and to the house of Judah as rottenness. When Ephraim saw his sickness, and Judah saw his wound, then went Ephraim to the Assyrian, and sent to King Jerob, yet could he not heal you, nor cure you of your wound. For I will be unto Ephraim as a lion, and as a young lion to the house of Judah. I, even I, will tear and go away. I will take away, and none shall rescue him. I will go and return to my place till they acknowledge their offense and seek my face. In their affliction, they will seek me early. Well, that's a reading for today. God's making it pretty plain. Hey, I'm going to bring all this on you. Then I'm going to go away. And I'm not coming back till you seek my face. Until you're willing to turn away from the things that you're doing wrong. You know, in all honesty, I believe that's what he's saying to us today. Lord, help us, folks. We're in dire straits. Until next time, may God bless you.